Hello everyone! Today our lesson will be about writing. We're gonna learn how to write a friendly letter. But before we start our lesson, let's read the day and date. So what is the day? Thursday. And what is the date? June 4, 2020. So, do you know what does a friendly letter mean? When I say friendly. Friendly. So, who's going to help me to answer my question? What does a friendly letter mean? A friendly letter is when you write a letter to a friend by greeting them. Excellent! So, you are going to write for your friends to tell them about uh, what happened with you or what are you planning to do or to go. So, you can write a lot of things to your friends. Okay, and as you can see everyone over here, there are five parts of a friendly letter. So, let's read the parts together. Heading, date, greeting, body, closing, and signature. Excellent. So these are the things that should be in our friendly letter. So when you write a friendly letter, you need to include all these points, the five points over here. Okay, so let's read them one more time. Heading, which is date, greeting body closing and signature well done so by the end of this lesson you will be able to identify the key features of a friendly letter and also you can write a friendly letter and here we go everyone copy and paste the link below in your browser and watch the introduction video about how to write a friendly letter so everyone after watching the video we get to know that there are some features of friendly letter that we need to follow when we write a friendly letter. So let's read the features together. Features of a friendly letter. It has a heading and greeting. It uses a friendly tone. It shares ideas and events with friends or family. And it has a closing and signature. So everyone, before writing a friendly letter, you need to be sure to memorize all these points because your letter or your friendly letter should include all these points. So let's explain each part or each feature of the friendly letter. Number one, heading. The heading tells when the letter was written. Two, greeting. The greeting is found at the beginning of the letter. It usually begins with dear and the name of the person you are writing to. The greeting ends with a comma. Number three, friendly tone of voice. A well-written friendly letter shows that the writer enjoys the friendship of the person he or she is writing to. 4. Share ideas and events. The writer shares ideas and things that have happened to him or her. Number 5. Closing. The closing tells that the letter is ending. The, wor the first word in a closing is capitalized. A comma follows the last word. Number six, the signature is the writer's name. Okay, everyone. So, you need to include all these points, okay? You need everyone to, um, you know, start with the heading. And the heading tells when the letter was written. So, you need to write the date, okay? After that, greeting. So, you're going to say, uh, Dear friend or dear Ali, dear Amna. And then you're going to add comma after that. 
Also, the friendly letter shows that the writer enjoys the friendship of the uh, person he or she is writing to. And after that, you're going to share your ideas and the things that you want to talk about. Finally, the closing. The closing tells that the letter is ending. Okay, and remember the first word in a closing is capitalized. A comma follows the last word. Finally, you are going to add your signature at the end of the friendly letter. And as you can see everyone, here is an example of a friendly letter. So let's look at the example because I want you later on to write the same. So here is the heading. heading. And as you can see, heading means that we are going to write the date. date after that the greeting you're going to say dear ali dear amna dear marwa okay whatever so you are greeting your friend after that you're going to add a comma here is the friendly tone voice excellent so you're going to talk about what happened with you or the things that you want to share with your friend okay after that is the closing okay you're gonna write your name and add your signature excellent and here we go everyone you have task one and task two so choose one of them okay so task number one, you're going to read the letter carefully and then you will, you will answer these questions. For example, when was this letter written? So highlight the date in the letter. To whom was the letter written? Highlight the greeting and so on. Task number two, what you are going to do is to write a letter to a friend or family member. Include all the parts of friendly letter in your writing. And I prefer that to do the second task. And after completing your work, don't forget to upload a picture or a video of it in your class dojo portfolio. Have a great day and happy weekend. Bye.